DIY Arduino-based smart barrier using stepper motor. Have you seen a level crossing or a toll booth barrier? A system that has to be manually opened when cars pass and closed when a train passes. Wouldn't it be great if you could make it smart and automatic? Today, we are planning on something similar using Arduino Uno and a few sensors and components. Today is Smart Origami Day. We need you to set up a few structures made of cardboard for beginning this project. Like always, it's safe to take a few precautions. If you are less than 16, do it under adult supervision. To get started, you require a few components. Controller. Arduino Uno. LED 2 pieces. Ultrasonic sensor. Servo SG90. Jumper wires. Double-sided tape. Cardboard box. Mini breadboard. 1K ohm resistance 2 pieces. Wooden ice cream stick. See how our system is working. And now, let's get started with the main construction. Place the cardboard on the table to begin construction. This is the Arduino. Let's place it on the cardboard. Place the PCB on the cardboard beside the Arduino. Place the mini breadboard beside the PCBs and let's get started. Connect a jumper from 5 volts pin of Arduino to one rail and from ground of Arduino to another rail of the breadboard. Let's connect the IN1 pin of PCB to pin 9 of Arduino. Connect the IN2 pin of PCB to pin 10 of Arduino. Connect the IN3 pin of PCB to pin 11 of Arduino. Connect the IN4 pin of PCB to pin 12 of Arduino. Connect the VCC to 5 volts and GND to ground. Connect the trigger to pin 7 of Arduino. Connect the echo to pin 6 of Arduino. Then, with double-sided tape, place the sensor. Connect the first LED positive to pin 11 of Arduino and the second LED positive to pin 10. With a 1K resistor in between, connect the negatives of both the LEDs to the ground. Connect the ice cream stick to the stepper motor and upload the code. Connect the power supply to the Arduino. We are using a 12 volts DC adapter for our project. Now, power up the system. If your device is wired up correctly, the smart barrier will open automatically when an object approaches it. Have fun experimenting with it. If you liked our video, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to get great content regularly.